Hi, welcome to Kitchen Chemistry with Essential Wholesale and Labs. I'm Tinika, and today I'll be explaining uh, the difference between volume and weight when we're talking about ingredients and why knowing the specific gravity of your ingredient is important. So let's just jump right into it. I have three um, ingredients here. I have water, I have uh, sunflower seed oil, and I have glycerin. And we're going to do a little experiment to show um, how weight and volume affect uh, your purchasing when you're buying ingredients. First, you can see that I've weighed out equal, or I've measured out equal amounts of each of these substances. So eight ounces of water, eight ounces of sunflower oil, and eight ounces of glycerin. So the first thing we're gonna do, we're going to take an empty container, put it on our scale, and we're going to tear out the scale, which of course means to zero it out so it takes away the weight of the container. And I am going to pour my eight ounces of water onto the scale and see how much that weighs. So for eight ounces of water, we have 0.4859, so almost a half a pound, so 0.4859. So I'm going to take this off the scale, and now I'm going to, again, place an empty container on the scale, tear out my scale so it's at zero, and I am going to measure out 0.4859 pounds of sunflower oil. Yeah. So, an interesting thing has happened. As you saw at the beginning of the video, I had eight ounces in volume of water and eight ounces in volume of sunflower oil. However, when I weigh it out, my water weighed 0.4895, and the same volume of sunflower seed oil only weighs 0.4102. So, it weighs less than water which is important, and we'll get to that. Um, so, let's do the same experiment with, with our glycerin. So again, we'll put the container on here, and we'll tear out the scale. And now I'll weigh out 0.4895 pounds of glycerin. I'm gonna do it like this so I can see. Okay, so with the glycerin, an interesting thing happened. So I have my 0.48, I guess 487, I could get more specific, but 0.48 basically um, pounds. So the same weight, the same weight of water and the same weight of glycerin. However, when we talk about volume, we have more water and less glycerin. And this is because water weighs less than glycerin. So let's talk about specific gravity now because that's where this comes into play. Every substance has a specific gravity and that is the ratio, the density, um, as it relates to uh, weight. And generally, when we're talking about specific gravity, we're talking about water. What does water weigh? So eight ounces of water weighs approximately a half pound. Eight ounces volume of glycerin does, weighs more than water. So even though these are the same weight, you can see that the volume is different. And with the sunflower seed oil, because it weighs less than water, we would need more sunflower seed oil to get the same weight as we would have in the water. So this is important because when you're buying ingredients, sometimes you buy in volume and sometimes you buy in weight. And knowing how much to order is very important. For instance, if you were to order a pail of sunflower seed oil, so five gallons of sunflower seed oil, and if you were expecting 40 pounds of sunflower seed oil to be in that pail, 
you would not be getting 40 pounds of sunflower seed oil. That's because when we talk about five gallons in weight for a pail, we're talking about the weight of water. And because sunflower seed oil weighs less than water, you're not going to be able to fit as much sunflower seed oil by weight into the same pail. So if you're needing 40 pounds of sunflower seed oil and you order a pail thinking you're getting 40 pounds, you're actually only getting about 38. So specific gravity of a substance can be Googled pretty quickly um, online and it will help you calculate exactly how much of an ingredient you're going to need to order. Since uh, most formulations are done by weight um, so that you can scale up and and uh, change the amount of a product that you're producing, uh, it's important to know what the specific gravity of the uh, ingredient that you're ordering is. So I hope this video made it a little clearer. We also have a blog on the same subject that might help explain it a little bit more. Um, Essentially is going to make ordering ingredients a little bit easier. Uh, we will be changing everything um, gradually to be sold by weight rather than volume, so it's a little easier to buy. So thanks for joining us today. We hope we made this uh, so somewhat confusing subject a little easier for you to understand. <laughs>